Welcome back to the vlog, guys. You're watching Samuel the Pro. Thank God you're recording. That made me yeah. really uncomfortable. <laughs> How'd you get that jersey? Oh, this jersey was um, handcrafted by no cares. I just want to say you better subscribe to the channel. That's hilarious. Colin, how's your day been? Dude, it's amazing. How was your ride down here? It sucked. Why did it suck? Because it was hot and the bus was like from 1800. What was your favorite part about the bus? The seats were like memory foam. They had memory foam in them. So it was very cushiony. Yeah, very cushioning. What was your least favorite thing about the bus? I got there wasn't a bathroom and it I'm smelled sure really were. bad in there. <laughs> oh yeah, and yeah, there was there no were, phone chargers. Know I, drove, I rode with my mom. Okay, was that fun? It was quite It was quite nice. I just watched TikToks the whole time, so. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what to be ashamed of, Brad. Why would I be ashamed of that? This is what you drink. Pib Extra. What's what better? Is this good food? Yes. Oh, I'm like crying about it. Show choir food. Bro, that looks like the Ole Miss yeah. game food. So you ever good. been there and gotten those nachos? No, I hate Ole Miss. What? Dude, it's nice to meet you. Thank you, man. So what's it like being on the wrestling team? It's not that fun, man. So what do y'all do? Like, y'all just like, <laughs> sit there and like tackle each other or what? No, it's complicated wrestling. It's high level. So how do you do it? You just like... Like, you just do it. Let's keep going. <laughs> so for the barbecue, nachos are sold? Yeah. All right, I'll get some of those. How do y'all make those things? Just chips, pork, and cheese. That's amazing. Y'all have an amazing night. Mm -hmm. uh, what? All right. Okay. Is it good? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Quality. Hold my drink, mister. Today we're trying to break into Jasper High School. Actually, no, we're already in. We're trying to break into the weight room so we can get big. Yeah, we interviewed a professional wrestler earlier. We did. His name was Ricardo Rollins. Dude, it's nice to meet you. Thank you. Yeah, they have professional wrestlers at this school because they're just that nice. They're mm -hmm. huge, too. I mean, they're like yeah, probably yeah. like 7'6", 340. Yeah, this school's pretty big. They got an ice skating rink, horse riding arena, a football, a football field, field mm -hmm. four gyms, three weight rooms, 67 classrooms. They got a soccer field. They have a softball field and a baseball field. They have a magician room, which is kind of irrelevant. Uh, yeah. Tonight, we are going to get a dub at the show car competition. Yeah, I hope so. Let's, um, as long as see, he I remembered power his power cord yeah, this week. Power 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 power. So we have tonight. a much better chance of scoring yes, here. You know? I think that Republicans should take over, but not Donald Trump. See, in my opinion, he's the greatest president we've ever had. Well, he, he said you're going to keep America great, but in order to keep it great, it has to be great to begin with. Let's um, think about how much our economy has spiked since Obama has been president. Michael Politics. Bloomberg should not be president. He is not epic at all. We are now a politics channel. So we're going to talk about <laughs> politics and we're going to like bring you news on flood. All right, so the current river level is 35.7 last time I checked on the boat. There's even flooding in Alabama. Oh, you really? see the freaking flooded golf course? No, every five minutes he goes, oh, look at that flooding. Oh, look at that flooding. <laughs> okay, Are you? I'm 15. I'm sorry that I've offended you. No, it's not that you offended me. I can oh, get this guy's number. Me? Yeah, you. <laughs> All right, don't call me past nine o'clock. My bedtime's at nine. No worries. Stop. There you go. Greg. <laughs> Mac woman? No, it's Greg McGowan. <laughs> My Greg gosh. McGowan. They all get that wrong. About to pop up on the screen. Hey, y'all like acrobatics in y'all's high school show? Uh, I mean, I wouldn't call it that. that. It's just some, you know, some kids doing some backflips. I mean, they're all. It's all fun. It falls under the same category. Well, all right, okay, so this guy did not realize that I'm from Mississippi. Even though okay. we're in this. What do you think about Republicans? Donald Trump knows what he's talking about. So what do you think about Democrats? Democrats? <laughs> oh my god, we can't eat meat! Oh my god, the world's melting! <laughs> we met this guy, his name was Ricardo Millen. Dude, it's nice to meet you. Thank you. He was like 6'3", big jack guy. <laughs> we interviewed him for the vlog. What did you ask him? Please don't tell me you asked him what he thinks about Republicans. <laughs> so what do y'all do? Please don't tell me you asked him that. So how do you do it? You just like... Did you ask him that? Like, you just do it. Hey, you have the hardest of all. Okay. I'm speechless. Hey, y'all are interrupting. I don't even know what this channel is anymore. We do like vlogs sometimes and then we bring you news stories sometimes. Give you everything. Yeah, so we're on the everything channel. Right? So, thank you for that. You should subscribe to Samuel the Pro. Hit the notification bell. This section is turned off for content made for kids. Are you serious? <laughs> Your content is not made for kids. I'm gonna do a better interview than that next time. What do you think about the Republican Party? If you want me to be honest, I hate politics, so I don't care about them. What do you think about Donald Trump? <laughs> I mean, he's cool. I don't like politics, oh, so I don't want to talk about yes. it. What do you think? Not politics. Okay, what do you think about Wendy's Baconator? <laughs> I've actually never had it. 
<laughs> Cameras have these things called lenses on the front. Well, no, and that shines on your face. Back, and it reflects there. Okay. Hey, you watched the um, Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon? Dude, I love him. I love his thank you letters. What's y'all saying? Theme. Our theme is... <laughs> so you What's, our like team? What's our team? Our that high school guy, he sailed across the Atlantic Ocean, and he thought he was gonna hit the um, he thought he was gonna hit Asia. Those Found islands. out he fell off the map because you know Democrats think it's flat. Have you not ever seen the 360 degree girl? She says that if it's 360 degrees, that it's not the same if it's 180. Like I don't know how to explain it. That is basically Jesus. Lord have mercy, don't shine an LED light in my. Eye. Okay. All right, that's enough for tonight's content. Let's shut that off. Good God, my eyes are burning. Yeah, is that a Kosciuszko? Okay, so like, look, you're right, Jackson. Kosciuszko. Okay. I knew you were kind of messed up when I first walked up and Wait, saw you, but like, y'all see Jackson right here. Yeah. yeah. You know where Hattiesburg is? Yes. Hey, you've been to Ed's. It's literally next you've been door. To yes, it's literally next Bro, door to Hattiesburg. That is the place. I have better food at my own house. It's, it's way too overpriced for their flavors. I'm sure you've never had a real steak. All right. Have you? <laughs> huh? I've had it straight out the field. Took it to the stockyard. They killed it. Well, not the stockyard. That's where we sell them. But we took it. You to the hunt? Yeah. I hunt. You're a country boy, aren't you? Yeah. You drive your own truck? Nah. Oh, that's I'm sad. 15. I'm sorry. I've been driving since I was five. I'm so speechless as this whole situation. I've been driving since I. Was they got me some muffins. I mean. Mittens, not muffins. <laughs> this is NBC News, and we're here with Mr. Thickpan. What do you think about the U.S. government currently? Yeah, I'm thinking that. Well, that's a very, that's a very topical question. I feel like the government right now is at a very solid point. You know, the branches, like the on a tree and stuff like that, the, they, they need to function. What do you think about the current U.S. government? <laughs> um, technically, I really feel like um, we can improve, and I think uh, the Tigers should take over. I oh. don't agree <laughs> with things. I feel like we should have an all animal based government. Yeah, I agree. Um, I, I feel like the sloth should be the president because nothing bad would happen. They'd yeah. be too lazy, like the bombs would happen. And then um, this is our vice president, Alto. All right. Um, he brings yeah. good luck, so that's that's my opinion. Thanks. That'd be good. My sister's better content than me. Think about Lane Kiffin. <laughs> the Lane train is coming to Oxford. Yes. And he is going right. to lead us to a national championship. What do you think about the U.S. government? Instead of people, we should have nothing. Huh? Exactly. <laughs> oh, how is that for you? Is it good for you? Pretty good. So, I don't care what anybody says, Donald Trump is the most legendary president we've ever had. Why, why are your chips different colors? That's the real question. Why do you have red chips? Because if you just do one chip, some people will say that it's racist because it'll be all yeah, white. I, I agree. Let's talk about um, um, the State of the Union address the other day with Nancy Pelosi. Um, Dude, why don't you rip up the paper? Um, you know how many trees probably died the real in that I, one tree? I think that the government needs to be more concerned about the global warming and the impact that cutting down all these trees is having on the environment. It's I think they need to cut out all this electric stuff and start just running on gas again. <laughs> See, life was good and we were just running on gas. Now we should go plant trees, but no. Aren't they good? These are amazing. Don't know, tell me. Samuel, what do you think about Rex Bradshaw? I think Rex Bradshaw is a really chill geography teacher. But Mr. Bradshaw did not give me a hundred on my current event council. What are your thoughts on the Mexican government? Oh yes, I Mexican honestly know government. nothing about the Mexican government. What are your thoughts on the Mexican government? They're racist. They need to go back to where they came from. <laughs> they probably got cameras and they're watching you. This is the O'Reilly Show. Oh, 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 O'Reilly! <laughs> All the parts. <laughs> What do you we think following back in? about the rodeo? Um, I think that the rodeo is I'm pretty so dope, but like, one day I strive to be in the rodeo. So. Yeah. Okay, okay, I just want to say to Mary May, Lily, and Mary Elise out there watching something. this video that this is the OG vlog squad right here. It <laughs> is. You don't understand what we've been through. You didn't get to interview Ricardo. Yeah. Dude, it's nice to meet you. I want to styrofoam so. biodegradable. Yeah. It does not make any sense yeah. at all. Yeah. Back in the day, when I was a kid, we didn't have any of this stuff like this. Uh -huh. You see all this like fancy like electricity lights? It's just crazy, man. Did it hurt? What? And you fell from heaven? <laughs> Can you tell me what it's like to be on outer space? It's amazing. You can just float all day long. What do you think about um, our president, current president Donald Trump? Better than a Democrat. They're talking about Donald Trump. Oh yeah, he looks like. How do you feel being the biggest lady puller here? You know, I'm not surprised by it. Alright, well that's enough today. 16 WAPT News out. What is it like living in the Nance household? Um, it's very difficult. The thing is, when they like are there, like I'm not. So like, oh, not. yeah, like we never there. Like when we eat dinner together, yeah. like my eyes just get loose. So like, that's really difficult. How has Cruz Nance influenced your life? He sits at home and plays video games. So like, he doesn't do much. But like, when 
and I do let him play with my ostrich, it like flies away. So. All right. So what do you think about our current U.S. government? You know, I would say it could be better, but like I wouldn't know how to make it better, so I really can't be talking. What do you think about our current president, Donald Trump? Twenty twenty all the way. This is the man right here. What do you think about the current U.S. government? It's kind of wild, yo. As a student who has taken AP okay. Golf, what do you I think? don't remember that much. I'm a chemistry major. What do you think about Nancy Pelosi? She's kind of scary. She ripped up that paper, right? Yeah, yeah. That was pretty rude, yo. Yep. Her comment on, on the air was, I think it was very courteous considering the circumstances. That tree died to be for that paper. That's bad for the environment. Okay, so we're here with Walker, the real politics yeah. man over here, yes. and he knows everything uh, there is about like anti-capitalism uh, and all the like for, communist for stuff. Sure. What's your opinion of um, the coronavirus happening in China? China is stupid. China is bad. So being a big man in the government, you were a page this week. That is correct. What was that like? It was actually very, very boring. We did absolutely nothing, and um, I learned that Congress does nothing. They just go in there and they congratulate everybody for doing nothing. Would you ever consider working for Congress someday? Well, they basically give you free money, so yes, I would do that. So what do they do in there? Do they just scream? each other and argue about which law is better or something well, like that? Well, usually they just are like, hey, it's a pretty good day. Um, You know, we'll clap some things, and then one guy will yell about how some bill is stupid. What's your opinion of our tax dollars going to pay these men's salaries? Oh, that's, that's a great idea, because then it gives me the ability to go page and take more of your money. What do you think about Democrats, Walker? The Democratic Party is not very good. They do not usually know what they're doing. They think that government should be big, but then that takes all of your money, and um, unless it's going into my pockets, it should not be like that. This has been Samuel LaFro. You should go subscribe. Hey, he means it. Go actually subscribe. If you also Don't just watch this If you all subscribe, then I get to get paid one day, so... And then you get more content. Yes, more, more amazing content. High quality content. I can buy more stuff. What's it like being a stud? Uh, just wake up in the morning and take a shower. Hey! Burn it. Hey, Tim, what do you have to say? Um... I feel like we did really well. Oh, it's a blog day. This is for the blog, okay? I got a kiss for the blog. What is your relationship status? Well, you see, back the other Wednesday ago, I figured out the square root of 13, and so, married, boy. What you mean? Pickles. I got a special trick, you ready? Alright, y'all follow me. Uh, we gonna right. go. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hey, I see your belly button. All right, so we're about to go into awards. We're gonna be insane. Maybe show Tom one. Maybe we didn't. We're here, we're here outside the auditorium. We're gonna have chaos. Um, How long have y'all been dating? Like a year. And oh, so that's my brother. If you had to give people advice, what would you say? Don't ever host a middle school competition. <laughs> Mr. Thomas Earl. Yes. How do, you, how do you feel about your solo comp performance tonight? I feel weird. Why, why do you say that? Because it was weird. All right, now, now we're good. I mean, thank you for your time. You got it. Um, we'll see you later. How long have you been dating? I only love Jesus Christ. What advice do you have for the young viewers out there? Keep your grades up. Reinstate the Oh yeah. Feel the hot off the love. I got my first kiss tonight. Will you bring back a socialist union for the United States? Of course. I will bring back the Communist Party. Communism. Communist the way. Um. So, what advice do you have for the young viewers out there who are looking for inspiration? What is your current relationship status? And you have, you have any nicknames, sir? Big sexy. This is Miss Ray. This is our show time director. Miss Ray, what do you think about the current U.S. government? 17. We're going in. What's just luck? What are your advice to younger people as they're like coming up? Like, do they need inspiration? You got this, and it's easy when you get on the floor. Um, don't be an idiot. Very good. Very good advice. Thank you very much. What's it like being a professional vlogger? Um, being a professional vlogger is really cool because when you get a thousand subscribers, you get paid to do it. So. so how much do you get paid? How much that right. Well, you get paid per view, so... Yeah. What's y'all's prediction for the score tonight? Y'all think y'all got first place? Uh, no. 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 Uh, maybe second or third or fourth or fifth or sixth. She might win solo comp though. She told me I was a blossoming star. Currently getting over my boyfriend. Wishing I had a boyfriend. Mentally dating Joshua Batson and Tom Holland. Our next topic we're going to talk about is Jackson Academy football. We hired Lance Pogue this year as our head coach. And since then, our football team has been grinding, working for That is so true. Year. Everybody on the team except me has been grinding. This is out of days of energy. I don't understand. 
dude. It's been amazing. Yo, it's, we've been getting lit up. We have here, been dude. litting this place up. Subscribe to Samuel Dupro. I this is, this is, a, this is an emotional night, you know? We won first runner up and I got my first kiss, you know? I said, I said, I said, hey, can I get a kiss with the vlog? And she goes, yeah, sure. Get a kiss with the vlog. My sister's better content than me. That's hysterical. That's like saying she's a better child than I am. Thank you so 